in the presentation of, a, of an addition to the bylaw. And it's very simple, but the paragraph that comes with this, these agenda items that are listed is not at all in the form of a bylaw. It's a very casual, informal statement. And I say that you need to formalize these procedures for current and future board members so that when agenda items come forward, we have a process in place because I don't think this idea that we're just going to somehow casually sit around and, and look at these agenda items and casually concur or, or you know not on these agenda items is really going to be appropriate for board procedure. You know, as elected public officials, I think we owe it to the public to formalize it and write it up. And it's not there's no problem with changing a system and a format, but it needs to be written up as an addition to uh, board bylaw. Madam President, if I, if I might, I mean, it, it, this is clearly an attempt to try to uh, take um, suggestions for board um, for board uh, agenda items and, and, and to bring that to the board in an attempt to try to uh, appease the board member who's trying to place these items on the agenda and to you know, honor that the request. Uh, I think that uh, attempting to honor that board member has failed. I think we should just move on. Uh, you know, I, I see what you're trying to do. I, I think it's, I think it's a, you know, I think it's uh, admirable to try to work through some sort of a process to aid us in getting beyond this, but it's not working. So let's just, uh, it would be my recommendation that we just move forward and move the agenda. So your recommendation is that we not discuss this item at all? Just move the agenda. I think that's an appropriate request. And so by that process, the superintendent and the board president would determine the agenda. And, um, um, okay, I will just make a simple statement. I was the one that suggested that we place the items on the agenda in this manner because um, a board member has felt that their um, requests were being thwarted and we also wanted to honor other board members' requests for consideration. I felt that we needed to treat all board members' uh, requests equally and we needed to establish once and for all when as you indicated, one item did not receive support, whether it was placed, should be placed on the agenda repeatedly. Um, this was, so to speak, a pilot to determine if the board could reach consensus about the work it wanted to proceed on so 